Yeah, this is Pops Cooper, livingcooper.com, with the Coop Simple How To. And this is my vlogging setup that I got, a little camera setup, which I don't know really how much I'll use it for vlogging. It's mainly going to be used for my wife doing her videos, and then I'll be using it for a desktop setup for doing uh, other product reviews. All y'all guys know I'm uh, new to this YouTube thing, so I've been trying to get the new equipment, better equipment, get stuff together. And I got me a new camera. I got the Canon EOS M3. And uh, so far, I've really enjoyed it. I'm using it right now. Using this camera and having a you know a tripod for it and everything, uh, I was looking around on YouTube, obviously. And uh, I was watching Caleb over at DSLR Video Shooter. And he had a vlogging setup. And I thought, well, this is a pretty nice setup. I'll have to go check him out. I think I want to build this setup. Nana, she likes to use her phone to make videos, so she prefers the phone. I prefer the camera, and this uh, little tripod setup that Caleb has over there is really it's good for both. Nana uses it to set on a, the desktop or the uh, the countertop when she's doing some cooking videos or or whatever, and it's uh, looks like a pretty good little setup. So I'm going to I got all the parts together, and I'm going to put this thing together and. You know, see how it works out for us. Keep watching and uh, see how I put it together. Okay, so right now I'm using the internal mic on the Canon camera. Uh, but I do have a, a Rode uh, video mic here that I'm going to be using with this new setup. And I have used it in the past with this camera as well. So but we're going to hook this up to this setup here. And hopefully we'll get it all together here in just a few minutes. Okay, so here's here's what we got. We got a tabletop tripod, and then and these got links in the description and everything. And I'll I'll also put links in the descriptions of the ones that I use uh, as well. This is the cheaper one that he suggested, the near or newer. I don't know how you pronounce it. And we got the articulating arm, the articulating arm there, and then we got a, a ball joint. We got a, a quick release clamp and plate for the camera. And uh, this clamp goes there. Then we got this clamp for the iPhone, my wife's iPhone, and the Rode uh, video mic. I, I guess I haven't watched the video. I had this before I uh, watched Caleb's video, and he, he has a link in his description of a video to watch before you buy this so I haven't watched it I don't know what he thinks about this mic but I've used it I've had you know good results with it and so I don't know what he has to say about it so but that's what I'm gonna use all right so let's see if we figure out how to put this thing together so mainly the configuration that, that we're going to be using it in is for my wife to use with her iPhone so I won't really be needing this portion at this point in time this is the quick release plate and uh, clamp and plate. So we'll just kind of set those aside for the time being there. I've got my iPhone and, and we'll see if we can figure out how to how we're gonna put this together. So first thing we'll do, I guess, is uh, we'll go ahead and put this on to looks like it probably goes on to the ball joint here at the top. Because of this uh, Rode Video Mic, this little hot shoe adapter here, I don't know how well get you guys can see that, but that's a 3 8 inch. And this ball head is a quarter inch, so we have to use that quarter inch to a 3 8 step that up, and then uh, put this thing on. So there you go, there's the mic. The mic is on. Now, put on the... Let's see if I can figure out how this thing works. Looks like this uh, clamp clamp screws in here onto this little ball head on the end of this arm, and then we can clamp it onto our tripod. So that's on the tripod like so, and this is a pretty nice articulating arm where you can kind of set that up however you need to set it up. Pull this off here because we have another 
a ball joint that will stick on here. So, and I don't really even know that I need this ball joint here actually. It looks like that uh, this would have screwed on. Our iPhone holder would have screwed directly onto, onto here like so. Okay, so here's, this is the setup. Let's see how, how it works for us. And then of course the iPhone will go here, maybe. So I also got this uh, adapter for the iPhone 7 for my wife, the SC4. Let's see, you get the dome. So I got the dongle. If, if you have an iPhone 7, you know that you need a, a dongle because they got rid of the headphone adapter or the audio jack rather. So we'll stick the dongle in and from what I understand it's very important to connect the uh, mic jack and the mic onto the dongle first and then hook it up to the iPhone, otherwise the iPhone won't recognize it, will think that you're going to use the, in the intro microphone, so I uh, hope well, I can keep this together here. So we got our, our mic set up, and this kind of seems unstable, so it doesn't seem very stable at all. Okay, well, there's the there's the setup, uh, but it really kind of seems unstable. I don't know how well this is actually going to work to do what we wanted it to do. It seems to be a little better there. Well, that might work. I don't know. Uh, let's, uh, I guess let's do a little test and, and see what happens. All right, everybody, here's a little setup that uh, Kayla from DSLR Video Shooter uh, kind of put out, the little vlogging setup that I'm using. I don't have my phone in here. As you can see, I have it attached up here to another little uh, phone clip, smartphone clip. And then I have the Rode Video Micro. And then this is actually the clamp for the, the cell phone. And then this is the near desktop tripod with a, the ball head comes on it. This is an articulating arm right here with the ball head on it. And then I have the dongle, the Apple dongle for my iPhone 7 going to the Rode SC4 adapter. The Rode SC4 adapter that goes into the Rode uh, uh, Video Micro Pro. So here it is. So also I'm, uh, I got my cannon hooked up to this uh, Exori's uh, transformer articulating tripod. You can check that video out, my little review on that thing. It's actually, I've, I've been impressed so far. Uh, I like it. I've been able to hang it on a tree and with the trunk where, you know, it won't, the arms won't reach around the trunk. but. Uh, it's got little spikes and so it'll hang in there pretty good. So this is Pops Cooper, livingcooper.com. Uh, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, share, comment. I'll leave uh, links to all the all the pieces and parts I use in the description below. Check them out and maybe you can set something up uh, that works well for you too. Thanks Caleb for posting that uh, vlogging setup video. Appreciate it. I know it's been a while back since you posted that thing, but uh, like I said, I'm just pretty new to this. And so I just found it, checked it out, and I like it. Y'all have a good one. See you next time.